Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Princess of Aesthetically Princess. Hi, hello. If you are new here, hi, I am Princess. Uh, here on my channel, I do a multi multitude of things from all types of lifestyle to art to journaling. And today we're doing some lifestyle stuff because I'm showing you guys my bedroom. So I know you guys have probably seen my bedroom before in any of my vlogs, but if you've never watched one of my vlogs before, and you've never seen what my bedroom looks like and now I have cleaned it up it looks nice and I have moved a bunch of stuff around because usually I I know I have this problem I will <laughs> change the positioning of my room uh, about like three two to three times a year just because the energy of my room just switches or I get new items and I just want to switch everything around a little bit but I am currently at <laughs> a new positioning in my room and I've figured out how I want it especially because I have a new item which is my big desk um and so I want to show you guys my room so let's go okay so this is what my room looks like when you walk in through the door this is my door um right at my door I have my yoga mat because I do do yoga sometimes I have some bags on the door and right next to my door is my light fixture or my like um my light switches as well as this little petite <laughs> um measurement signs for my pants because I always forget what size my waist is and what size my pants are down so I'm a 28 by 28 so I usually keep it right by my door so I can remember it and I just have it on the door I have it on the wall and it can just easily tear off and no problems then I have my door to my closet which I do not use often but I will show you guys my closet closet momentarily when we do the rest of the room and that is all from the front of the room so once you walk in and close the door right next to it is this little area so I have some art stuff some paintings that I'm currently trying to sell um, my art cart with all of my markers up top sorry I'm out of breath easily um, my paints and paint bottle all my paint bottles and brushes and palettes and stuff in the back I have some um, markers some spray paint on the bottom all is my ship this is all my shipping stuff for like all my paintings and all of my orders and right next to it, I have my snack food and my mini fridge, cereals, my little electric tea kettle, um, my teas and coffees, and then I have these two mugs because they don't fit on my mug tray. This one and this one, very nice, very nice. I have this little um, post thing that I have not finished yet, so it just stays right there. And then some alcohol, and that's about it on this side of the room, except for this, which is a bunch of fabrics my mom is, she makes, um, tutus and things like that so she has a bunch of fabrics that she just kind of strung together and gave to me because I love the color of pink and it was a very nice aesthetic so it looks very nice <sighs> goodness I'm out of breath hello me this is my um little dresser my mirror never got mounted when we moved in and it's been too long so I don't really care and I don't really use it and then it feels more comfortable for it not to have it mounted at all so I'm okay I'm okay with that but this is my dresser all of this side is like shirts um, formals, uh, PJs, and sleep shorts. I have this closet, this little cabinet, which is all of my shoes, all of my formal shoes, and then a bunch of boots. And then I have underwear, socks, and then all of my sweatshirts and sweatpants. Like, up top is all of my headbands and ribbons in this little container, in this little bottle right here. This is my, um, bridesmaids cup for my mom's wedding um this little fake succulent all of my meds some sunglasses and some and only some of my jewelry so i also have these these are um fat garters that i used to wear i don't really wear them as much uh necklaces bracelets and watches then we have my favorite part of my room which is my um little tea tray here i have a bunch of kettles i have hand sanitizer that i always keep up here um my little um reusable cup more hand sanitizer Alice, um, some more mugs and things like that, <laughs> as well as some strainers, as you can see right here. And then I have some tea right here. I don't drink this tea, it is just for aesthetics. It's disgusting. Uh, I love Pinky Up, but I do not like either of these teas. They don't taste very nice to me, but I have them nonetheless. They're very pretty to just use as for aesthetic because they're all loose leaf. I don't know if I can open them with one hand, but these are all loose leaf teas, as you can see. So sometimes they look pretty, sometimes they do not. Oh, the smell. I opened them, my bad. Then back here I have all of my makeup. I don't really wear as much makeup as I used to, but um, and I have all this makeup just back here. I've never cleaned this out, it needs to be cleaned out. And I have my brushes and um, some of my empties from uh, prior skincare. And then these are all of my empty bottles that I've collected, Kavita and some Starbucks. And then these are letters and um, cards from 
either people who I've ordered stuff from so I have like business cards and things like that or little stickers from the rural days or pen pal stuff they're a nice place to put them then of course the trash can disgusting and my bed my bed is a twin size bed I had these sheets are all from Target these are all just white sheets from Target I switched between my white ones and my pink ones which I'll show you there in my closet and then I got this from a Joann's one year and because I really liked it, it was pretty white, I have it. Then on this side of my bed, I have this painting of this little black and white painting from Paris, a candle, two boxes, and my bedside lamp that I don't use. I never use this lamp and I don't think it works anymore. And then I have a bedside hand sanitizer just in case I'm in bed and my feels, hands feel dirty. And then I have my cookie jar I these are cookies from Walmart actually that I need to go back and buy they're like three dollars for a box and the box fits in here very nice very happy by the way if you're ever looking for easy decor especially seasonal Walmart has these cookies that are always seasonal they're sugar cookies they're covered in sprinkles and you can get them in any shape that pertains to that month or that um upcoming holiday and they fit in that jar and they have a big containers and it tastes great I love them then I have this mug that um, I can't use because it has a crack in it, um, this one, and inside it have some um, ear cleaners, a scrunchie, some um, oils for my humidifier, and then my chapstick that I keep beside my bed. I have some markers, my thing of candy, my remote for my switch, and then my actual remote. And then I have some meds, this tray that I use. Sometimes I use it to eat breakfast on. I'll pull it over and I'll just sit in bed and eat breakfast on my tray. Um, so a book and two of my finished sketchbooks. As you can see from the corner, I have this little Starbucks sign as well as some posters and stuff that I just have over here that I do not touch. Um, but this Starbucks sign is from a play that used to be at my school, but I ended up taking it when they got finished with the play. And I love it and it sits here along with <laughs> my uh, reusable Starbucks cup that I've had for forever. Then we have my TV. I think this is a 44 inch. I know, I think it's smaller. Um, this is a good inch TV, good size TV. Behind it is the switch. Um, and here I have my salmon colored blanket and pillow. And then my um, thing to connect all of my uh, electronics. I always unplug it when I go anywhere because I do not like to have each electronic plugged up when I travel. So I always unplug everything in my room everything everything and then I have um, this is like the heating pad for when you're on the period and then I have my little cutter that I need to move actually now that I think about it to up here onto my desk um, right next to it I have my um, my lightsaber some gift baskets a box for my um, printer my little picture printer a pumpkin for the fall time when I do fall decor I just like to put it out um, a little sitting on a box and all of my reusable bags that I try and make sure I always take one of when I go shopping so I have one from like Walmart Target I have one from Disney um, I have one from Publix all those places I like to make sure I get one so I can use less on this side I have my skates and then some flowers some fake flowers for, for photo shoots and like things like that okay on top of my desk on the other hand as you can see, this is my view. It shows right in front of my street. I have a huge bush here and a rose bush on the other side. <sighs> Everything is not fun. But on my desk, I have my Cricut along with my Cricut mat and some papers from um, a project. My stand, my little arm stand. My chair with my blanket on it. This is just a black chair that I've had for my grandparents had that my granddad had built and I just spray painted it pink and it looks kind of weathered and cool and cute and whatever. I don't know, have no idea where I got this blanket from. I just had it for forever. Next to it is my little organizer. All of my stickers for all of my um, releases are right here and then I have some clips for my journal and then my um, permanent sticker stuff some postcards some more journaling stuff and some thank you notes then up top you have my markers for that month so whenever i journal i try and keep the mark markers that i'm using for that month close to me my journal um my sketchbook another journal another journal and some paper ruler 
more items for stationery and stuff like that. And then I have these dried baby's breaths that I have just to look nice. <laughs> then I have, this is my Kodak camera and then my camera printer, camera printer. My purse that is just kind of sitting here. Usually it hangs off the side of my um rack here, but um, it's too heavy for right now and I haven't cleaned it out recently. Then back here I have Grell and Sebastian. Oh, I forgot to show you my very protective Batman who I keep right next to my bed because I believe he sleeps. He uh, watches me while I sleep. Very protective, very good omens. We love Batman. Then right next to my desk, I have my mirror. I come here, I take pictures sometimes. Hello. And then I have, I have one hat here, um, three hats here and another hat here. The rest of my hats are actually underneath my bed in my little basket. More hats. And these are containers that have just random stationery and stuff in them. Oy. And then back over here, my little purse set, my um, a bag from a small business that is no longer open, my uh, Expressions NYC, and then my Alto bag, who I love very much. And then I have my little place of shoes. I have heels on this side, flat shoes on this side, including a pair of sandals. And then right up here, I just recently bought these tulips, but they're already dying, so they're a little fugly. Um, and then I have some jewelry and then my Google Home. Here in this basket, I keep all of my bandanas and my masks for Billy the House. And then I have this cute painting that I think I got from like a Ross. Amy Wong, whoever that is. Very nice. I've had it for years. Then, of course, this is my... This right here is what you usually see at the back of my videos. Very, very nice looking. Very pretty. This is just my my white, pink, and black clothes. This is just the colors of here. My boots. All of these boots are either black or this pink. Um, I have one other hat right here, so that's very nice. I got these hangers from, like, a Ross as well. They're all gold with a little felt pink so nothing really slips off very nice finally we're almost done my dirty clothes hamper that it stands in front of my closet because i never go in here and then i have my umbrella under my under umbrella and then i have my closet these are the bunch of bags that i do not use anymore but i absolutely adore all of these bags i bought them myself i have all of my apple product boxes up there with old shoes that i just never took the goodwill then I have the rest of my colored clothes, so some black clothes, gray. It's close, supposed to be in rainbow order, but probably has gotten out of order now. I don't really go in here at all because I don't really wear these clothes, ever. But I keep them just in case. And also sometimes my sister will come in here, she'll wear some of them. Now on the bottom I have this bag right here is my bag of um, all of my sketchbooks that I just have and don't have anywhere else to put them a few boxes to some items i have a lamp over here my suitcases are also in here and then my second comforter and then on the bottom i have some um brightly colored sweatshirts and stuff that i don't really wear so a bunch of the stuff in this closet is stuff that i just do not use or do not wear and so it's a place to store all that stuff until i can figure out how to clean them or get rid of them and that is all so that was a quick video of like my bedroom and things like that and I'm very happy with it. I'm very, I am very much like my bedroom. I think it's very convenient and I'll change it probably soon. It never stays the same ever. Um, I've changed this. I think the main thing that I change is I always move my picture taking stuff. So like all of my clothing and stuff to different sides of my room just to see how I feel. So like different additions that I've gotten over the past what summer I got this refrigerator I moved some of my boxes around I got my desk my Cricut so every time I get new items to my room I try and change it around to incorporate those items but it'll still make it look like my room um, and sometimes I just get really bad anxiety I just start redecorating my room I'll take everything down and move it around um, but other than that it makes me kind of happy to be able to do stuff like this so that's a personal thing. Now realizing it, I didn't show you what's down here. Pause. I didn't show you guys what was down here. All of my books. I'm a nerd. I've been a nerd for years and I just rarely 
show off these books because they're old books that I have. Um, I usually just read books online now. I usually read mangas and stuff like that online, so I never have physical copies. So this is what I do. This is where all of the um, my books and like have a trophy, my piggy bank that is extra heavy, and then some other random items like my LED um, items are down here too. And then in this drawer is all the miscellaneous stuff that I don't want to deal with. Back. But yeah guys, I hope that was helpful in any way. If you have any questions about any of the items in my bedroom, whether that may be my desk, which is from Ikea, or my clothing hanger, which is um, a DIY that I found on uh, YouTube, and then I just bought the items and did the DIY, let me know down below or if you are interested in why the fuck I did this to my room. It's just how my room functions. It just, it makes everything easier and much more accessible. I hope this was entertaining in some type of way. I don't really know. But thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.